25th of June 2019, a small package the size of a shoebox was aboard a SpaceX Falcon Heavy rocket launched into Earth's orbit from the Kennedy Space Center. One month later, that package was deployed and unfurled into a solar sail the size and shape of a boxing ring. Known as the Light Sail 2, this is the second attempt by the Planetary Society to demonstrate the feasibility of controlling small spacecraft by harnessing the power of the Sun. Particles of light called photons, which have no mass but do have momentum, collide with the reflective surface of the sail, bouncing off to impart a minuscule amount of push on the spacecraft. Similar to a sailboat, the solar sail pivots to harness light energy. Orbiting the Earth at 720 kilometers, as the light sail moves away from the Sun, it displays its full surface area to generate the greatest amount of solar push, increasing its speed. Conversely, as it approaches the Sun, it limits the surface area of the sail, preventing deceleration. This dance manages the propulsion of the spacecraft by endlessly increasing or decreasing its orbit, using only the power of the Sun. At its simplest, this technology keeps satellites in orbit, resisting the gravitational pull back to Earth. But without the need for rocket fuel, solar sailing allows for easier interplanetary propulsion too. Plans are already in place to use a solar sail to launch a secondary reconnaissance mission from the Moon to a near-Earth asteroid. Applying the same concept, a more ambitious group, Breakthrough Initiative, led by internet investor Yuri Milner, are investigating using solar sails blasted with photons from lasers rather than the sun to accelerate tiny spacecraft to 20% the speed of light, with the goal of reaching our nearest star, Alpha Centauri.